Hey everybody, it's Catherine from Dryer Days Art Studio, and in this video, we are going to be making these gorgeous coasters using everything that you are going to get in the February DD art box. I am so excited about these. I think they're beautiful. I have been waiting to get this box to you. It's been kind of a hectic start to the new year, but I'm all settled in and cannot wait to bring you this box. So first of all, I started with the 4-H D-Mold 8-10 to 10 hour cure epoxy from Tea Expert. Everything will be listed in the video description and I actually have a discount for the resin, so definitely check that out. So here in the box, you're gonna get holographic silver. You're gonna get a quarter ounce of my brand new onyx glitter. This is black multicolor, or I'm sorry, multi-size glitter. It's really, really pretty. You're gonna get purple mica pigment. You're also gonna get gunmetal mica pigment. I didn't list this in the listing, but everybody's gonna get a cool gray alcohol ink, amethyst color cream, and the black color cream, both 30 milliliters in those little jars. And you're also gonna get two of the DD Agate coaster molds. So I've already mixed this up. I mixed up some of the 4-H resin with silver holographic glitter. I have been letting it sit in this plastic bag, thickening up because I'm going to start with some lines first on these molds and we're going to see how that goes. I'm gonna do the same thing with some of the onyx glitter. I will have bonus content on these coasters from my patrons. So if you'd like some bonus content tips to know all the pros and cons and challenges and discoveries that I made while making these coasters, then please consider becoming a patron and supporting my channel and my work. I appreciate you just even if you're watching on YouTube, please like, comment, and subscribe if you're enjoying. All right, so after putting a little bit of clear in, I'm gonna come in now with amethyst color cream with a little bit of resin. I'm gonna actually mix a little bit of each of the pigments up. So we're gonna do some with the purple, some with the gunmetal, and some with the black.
right guys, and using my favorite new silver metallic markers that I got on Amazon, I'm gonna outline the outer ridge here with the more um, angled tipped marker. And I'm gonna go around the entire side of every part of both of these coasters. I'm gonna time lapse some of this so you don't have to watch me do it all, but just kind of keeping half of that tip right on that very, very edge to give a sort of an outline. And I think it just really adds some depth and kind of a highlight to the edge. So I'm gonna do this on both, like I said, and then I'm gonna take the fattest tipped of all of the markers. Sorry, I have to do some content for, you know, Instagram. So here's the bigger tipped one. You can see I'm shaking it and pressing the nib on my table and not anywhere near my pieces because I don't want to splash any of this on the surface of these pieces at all. So I highly recommend you kind of do that away from your piece. I'm just going to go around and do this on the entire sides of both of these coasters here. These markers are fabulous. I love them so much. Again, I have them linked below and I will have them in my Amazon store where you can find these. All right, there's a lot more bonus content on this video for my patrons over at patreon.com slash dryer days. The link is in the description. Look at these beauties. I did flood coat them. Again, you can hear about all of that over on Patreon. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you can run over and get the February DD art box before it is gone. I have the Kailua box over there too. That's my last week's video. So make sure you check that out. I just think the glitter and these pigments are so stunningly gorgeous. I hope you guys are having an awesome February. Happy Valentine's Day. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, everybody, keep on pouring.